reason why so many people poor is not because of poor working habits. Actually, most people work very hard. And the hardest working people are the poorest people. But most people are poor because of poor thinking habits. Just imagine if you would build a, build a house without actually setting out the plans, the house will collapse in a minute, in a matter of months, weeks. So this is how a lot of people go about their life, just building without planning first. Most people always grumble about their bosses. Their bosses are earning 5, 10, 15, 20 times more than their salary. And they always say, wow, the boss doesn't do anything. He just sits in his office or he just comes and goes. But the business thrives based on the boss's action. Why? That's because the boss does more thinking than physical work. So a worker is paid based on his effort. Of course, he's got a good working habit. That's his contribution. But the boss has the good thinking habit. He makes plans before he makes any move. So he's not making a lot of mistakes. He's not doing things two or three times. He makes error once and that's it. So most people are poor really because they have a poor thinking habit. They go about their life just walking, 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 never taking a time to think like, how can I make things better? How can I change? How can I take a direct, different direction? If things didn't work this way, how else can I do it? Just imagine, how many people do you know that have got two, three jobs that are wealthy, that are rich, that do that okay, that are financially okay? How many people can you tell me that have got more than one job that they are financially okay? And I'm not talking about business owners, entrepreneurs. I'm talking about people who physically work for money, just for hours to get paid. How many people do you know? Of course, those people are the hardest working people in society, but they're the poorest. If you go into any market in the developing nations, you see people lifting sack of goods, bags of goods, going to the depth of the sea, the river to bring up sand. They're doing the hardest jobs ever, but they get paid peanuts. Why? Because of the poor thinking habit. You see, when you refuse to think how to improve your life, then you end up working for it. You work with your body, use your power. They say brain and brown. So if you don't bring the brain, then you have to bring the brown. So most people are just poor, not because of lack of power, not because of they are not willing to get, but they are not thinking in the right way. They don't have a good thinking habit. They refuse to think. They always trying to leave the thinking to another person. Let them do deal with the thinking. How do they work? But the thing is, the person who does the thinking earns the money because he sets out the plan. Then he gets people to execute the plan, and he pays them, and he takes the bulk of the money. So if you're suffering, if your life is not where you want it to go, if you're starting afresh, just take a step. Take a time and just ask yourself, how can I do things better? How can I think better? How can I think myself out of this situation? So if you start thinking in that terms, how to think yourself out of situation, and rather how to walk yourself out of situation, you will start seeing improvements in your life, changes in your life, developing your circumstance wouldn't hold you you would make the circumstance you want you wouldn't complain and grumble and make excuses about your circumstances any circumstance you want you couldn't find you would make it for yourself because that's what thinkers do they take time to build things they take time to set things they analyze they observe they learn they talk to people that is what thinkers do they don't take whatever comes their way no they don't make do 
they find something is not there they think how can i put this thing in there this thing if i'm looking for this thing other people might be looking for this thing that's what thinkers do they invest time more in the thinking they say the best or the wealthiest people in this world they spend an hour a day just thinking just an hour every day they spend it just thinking in their homes in the offices they shut themselves from and they just relax pull a blank paper in front of them and just think about different opportunities different scenarios different angles how can they make things better and just imagine everything we're enjoying on this planet today they've come from someone's ability to think someone's ability to imagine something that was not there someone's ability to create something that was not there someone's ability to go into themselves and see something that was not there and how do, does all this thing come from they come from thinking they come from good thinking habit ability to think and they say your thing is like a car it's like a machine once you start it off it just keeps giving you idea it keep pushing you into that thinking place because why that's become its habit it's all about habit if you build the habit the habit becomes you but now if you build a poor thinking habit that becomes you as well it's like you you are what you eat so everything you're enjoying today from the cars to the planes to the ship to the earphones they have come from someone's ability to think someone's ability to imagine something that was not there and try and say i need this thing other people would need it how can i make it come to life or oh, how many how many hard workers have you seen going down in history is all about thinking this people who've taken steps to break the norm this people taking steps to do something that no other person has done that's when i talk about poor thinking habit so look into yourself say to yourself what is it that's holding me in this situation what can i change what can i do differently start thinking positively stop relying on just how hard you work your body will break down in certain matter of years but you could still retire and still be earning why because of you go a thinking ability that you've put something in place those who earn with their power their muscle their earning stops the day they stop using that physical power but those who think with their brain invest in the future when they stop they still making some income that's what thinking is all about thinking ability so start thinking from today stop focusing on just your power your energy your brain start thinking about the brain what can i change what can i do differently how can i work smarter and when people talk about smart working this is it this is part of it how can i work smarter how can i not just work with power power power? how can i use my brain how can my brain be the center of my world and that's what sets rich people apart from the poor people their thinking ability 